Wow, I'm happy. So happy to be back in Taipei after all these years. In this Taiwan travel vlog series, join me in exploring places such as climbing up Xiangshan, experience the amazing view of Beitou Jiao, and the wonderful experience of glamping in Xinzhu and more. First, I will need to buy my favorite Feng Mi Gu Ba Zi. I will always go to this store in Ximending. The store and the Ximending is still there, leh. After so many years of COVID, when many shops have closed, I'm so glad to see that they are still here. I've tried from many other stores, but somehow I still prefer the taste from this one. Okay, super hungry now. Let's grab some street food from all these stores. There's Chong Zhua Bing and Zha Ji Pai. This one, ah, Singapore also have, but in Singapore, I hardly eat. Come Taiwan, then eat, lor. Xiao Rai. Okay, lah. When you're hungry, everything tastes good. We ordered some tan bing, you tiao, and tou jiang for breakfast. Next stop, the iconic Ximen Hong Lou. Inside, there are many shops selling handmade crafts as well as cute locally designed goods such as t-shirts, bubble tea cup holders, and more. Many of these items are very unique and reasonably priced. Let's spend some time exploring and you might find something you really liked. That's like this cute Toy Story music box, which I end up buying. We are going to climb up Xiangshan. Let's take the Dan Shui Xing Yi Xian to Xiangshan Station and follow the path to the hiking trail. Going up the hill, up the hill. Wow, strong eh. Okay, let's begin our climb. Xiangshan is about 183 meters above sea level. It takes around 20 minutes to reach the top, depending on individual's physical level. There are stairs, and stairs, and more stairs.
finally, after 20 minutes, I can see the first observation deck. It was drizzling that evening and there was an overcast. But the view was still amazing. Okay, after burning all my energies climbing the elephant mountain, it's time to eat. This is the famous hotel big store, and there's always a long queue for it. But tonight, I'm not eating this. And not this also. So tofu is not really my thing though. Oh, my favorite clam soup. I ordered the big clams in garlic soup. Nice. Finally, for dessert, came to this famous Yu Ping Yuan Bing Huo Tang Yuan. There was a long queue outside the shop, but it was not a long wait as the table became available shortly afterwards. We ordered the popular Ping Huo Tang Yuan, and it was so good. So if you are coming to Rao He Ye Si, please come and try this, okay? In Taipei, there will never be a shortage of good food here. Dongsan Cultural and Creative Park is one of my favorite places to visit. It is located in the Xingyi district and is within walking distance from Guofu Jinengguan Station or Shizhenfu Station. Opened on November 15, 2011, the building it now occupies used to be a tobacco factory during the 1930s. It is currently the creative hub of Taipei, frequently hosting various artistic, cultural, and creative events. There are also many pop-up stores, as well as permanent spaces, showcasing many talented creative products from local designers and artists.
Next, let's go to Dadao Chen Matou Container Park along Dan Shui River. This is one of the best places in Taipei to view the beautiful sunset. This is also a popular park among cyclists. And nighttime spot on the pier with waterfront cafes and vendors. The best time to come is in the evening, so be sure to check the daily sunset time. Get some food and drinks from the many stores here and find your favourite spot to admire the sunset. If you have enjoyed my video so far, please remember to click the like and subscribe button and share this video to your friends. This will definitely help my channel a lot. Thank you for watching and see you on part 2 of my Taiwan vlog series.